Everybody, welcome to Epic Brew. I'm Tom. Today, I'm excited to check out the new Costello. I just loaded into the map for the first time since they redid it. Already liking what I'm seeing. I'm gonna crank the music down. My God, I'm still not, I'm still not used to that right there. <laughs> it's uh, you know, they say the saying, the face only a mother or a father could love. Well, I'm. I'm his father and I'm still disgraced by it but this is really nice it's there's a lot less clutter going on a lot like all this is cleared out they must have had a yard sale or something the flowers you know what it's nice I know more than houses about guts and glory and everything oh they cut the tree down too what the heck is this I'm I mean I'm digging the water we don't really get water in the game so so this is new right there's no where has there been water before like the rivers but i'm i'm saying like a standing body of water yeah i'm trying to think i don't think there's been like a little pond i i'm i might be missing something completely obvious but i'm actually trying to think grad has the river mountain peak it's I mean, it's all frozen. <laughs> uh, Crossroads is nothing. Uh, Fatoria. I don't think Fatoria has water. Oh, it's got the, the freaking harbor. Yeah. But this is, you know, a little pond. I don't think there's been a little pond. There's a long way to get to that statement. But the, the flowers add nice colors. I got to say, it's a nice little splash of color that's not black, gray, or red. Oh, this is wide open over here now. Look at that. So they cut. How did they do this? Okay. So. The wall that used to run right here is gone. They knocked that wall down. Which means. Yeah, because there used to be a ladder here. Do you remember? Oh, remember Saved by the Bell? I know some of my uh, OG viewers remember Saved by the Bell. But the bell is still here. It's just not where it used to be. It used to be like right here. So this is much wider. Okay. Okay. I mean. I, I'll tell you what. I like this up here for this area. Because it allows some uh, verticality for the defenders. To kind of pelt the attackers here because the the attackers i mean yeah sure they had to fight through this choke point right here the original one anyway and there was like that little ledge up here that you could kind of shoot down and then this is almost like too steep to be any good um plus they're just pouring out from over here anyway so i feel like this is back you know it's a safe distance but uh you know you have a really wide field of view to work with now and then what's going on over here? Oh, we still got, uh, I always forget the name of this painting, but if you know, you know. Oh, we still got some boys hiding here. We got a map. I like the, uh, <laughs> red team's like, they're right here. As if it's not completely obvious that, uh, we're going to be hiding out in the castle right there. Is this the new fire effects? It sounds nice. I don't remember off the top of my head if that's how it always has sounded. Oh, this is new. I think. It sounds like a f or yeah, this sounds like a liquid fire. And this sounds like a wood fire cuz you can hear the crackling of the wood. I guess, what is this, like a tar barrel that they flung over the wall, maybe? Let's see, let's see what this sounds like. What is this, just a piece of wood? Ah, the, the silent burning fire. Okay. It's three different types of fire sounds. Interesting. Oh, this is really cool looking. Hey, this looks really cool. 
This actually looks like they attacked. And then... So can we not go... Okay. I thought I could... I used to be able to spectate out there, I thought. Maybe not. Yeah, this looks really cool. You come in here, it's like, boom, they got the gates. Pew, they got pelted with the arrows. Some of the boys didn't make it. And then somehow... I don't really understand the physics here because it looks like the wall was blown outward. I'd love to know the lore of that. Of why the wall was blown out from the defending. <laughs> Like this is this is pretty cool right here. It do, it definitely looks a lot more like a war zone than it did. Castello was a bit too clean. In my mind, it was always like, oh, you know, this is the first battle here. So, but I do like that it progresses from this kind of like war torn, like fiery hellscape, and then it's like, oh, you know what? We got flowers. Yeah, flowers. How about that? Let's go check out over here. I didn't expect to spend as long as I am going through this map and looking, but there's actually a lot of nice changes I'm seeing. So they used to be able to go up into these. Because I'd always have problems when you're defending. Okay, this is totally the I remember this from my last video I did where I like did the, the before and after comparisons with the photos they te- Come on, birds, I'm trying to talk. Where are you at? Are you just a music box playing sounds of birds? There's no real birds, aren't there? Go through here. But yeah, so I remember this from the before and after video. I'm just like having fun just kind of like exploring around here. Don't mind me. I hope you're not expecting gameplay today because this is what we're going to be doing in today's video. We got the boys in here. Oh, look, you got you got more windows. You get a nice, uh, you be fighting in here. You get a nice breeze. Oh, this is interesting. That is interesting. Look at this. You, you have choices now. You can go out here and then maybe take a little tumble. Okay, I like this. I like this. Oh, what is this? Oh, interesting. A little barricade action going on. Set up some ballistas here, you know? I know some people who are going to dig that. Let's check upstairs. Ooh. Well, you can't get up here, I guess. So let's check the attic. Wow, the lighting is nice up here now. It's dare I, it's dare I say cozy up here, except, you know, don't ignore the human transportation cage and the human torture cage, but you know, it's kind of cozy up here. I gotta say, look at this. Oh, uh, look at that. It's old Castello. The memories RIP death bridge. RIP. Oh, you can still wait. You can still go up higher. You got the rooftop here. What are you gonna? Has this? Oh, I guess this has always been up here. I've always, I've seen like people occasionally like they're doing weird stuff up here. Look at that, man! That looks so much cleaner. It, the map. Oh, the mountains too. Have the, have the mountains always been there? Or is that new? Can I go out to those islands? Probably not. Look at this. I wonder if there's any Easter eggs. Look, wait a minute. Wait a minute. The castle's not built on a stable foundation. <laughs> think of the think of the earthquakes. Wait, what is this tunnel over? Is this a tunnel? We're going on an adventure, ladies and gentlemen. <laughs> what is this? Why is this here? It reminds me of those like when I was a kid and had the Hot Wheels. You know, like the little ramps. You put the car on the ramp and then it just kind of like 
goes off the ramp. Okay. This strangely large ramp. Like, is it supposed to be a dock? Maybe? They just forgot to build the dock. How far out can I go? Let's find out. We're going to Jurassic Park, everybody. Pterodactyls will come swooping in on us any second now. There's like a little house. Is there a way for me to like speed up the camera? Let's check the controls here. I don't want to change that. Spectator action. What are spectator actions? I don't know. Uh, it doesn't look like there's spectator controls. Cycle camera, kick drop. Yeah. Oh, spectator. Fly up, fly down. That's it. There's no speed up. It's going to be a minute, I guess. Watch. We get like halfway there and it stops. Can I go underwater? Let's, let's deep dive in here. Everybody hold your breath. We're in heaven. <laughs> Look at that. It's it's just two big blocks that they kind of crank together there. The, the illusion's ruined once you go below the waves. I want to see what's going on on this house or this island out here with the houses. I'm going to be disappointed if it stops me from exploring out here. I can't sprint or anything. E goes up, Q goes down. Space bar doesn't do anything, control doesn't do anything. Scroll up, scroll down, clicking. It's kind of crazy to think that everything that we know of Costello happens on that little tiny island. We're just a, a drop of sand in a great big universe. Also, it's a little weird that they would build a castle there and not like up there. This is a kind of a bad spot for a castle. You just get, you have four ships and you, you're done. You know, like you build the castle up there. You can like make tunnels that go everywhere and nobody will know where you all escape to. I mean, I'm no medieval engineer, but that's just my thought process. Maybe that's why Costello's <laughs> the defenders always lose because they built a castle on a tiny island. Okay, here we go. I'm surprised I'm making it all the way out here, to be honest. Oh, no, the match is going to end. I'll have to join another empty server, I guess. But at least we're getting out here to explore this one island. It's going to be totally just vacant, isn't it? <laughs> it's totally vacant. No Easter eggs. They let me go all the way out here. I thought there might be like a little skeleton or something fun. Can I go? Oh, you can go in the building. I don't think I'm going to make it over that way. So I tell you what, I'm going to beat the buzzer and just leave the server. Let's go to the main menu. Oh, oh my goodness gracious. He, yeah, oof, he's rough looking. Let's find a different, another empty Costello server. That one's got, oh, I think this is the one I was in. Where are we at? Costello, Costello. Oh wait, I saw one right here. Look at all these. I have the filter set to show the empty servers. So it's doing its best Chivalry 2 impression right now. Too soon? Is that too soon? Okay, let's get back up. Okay, I won't go off the map again. I just really wanted to see at least one of those islands. Where are you at, bird? Where are these birds at? Okay, so let, let me think where we left off. We were in the attic, we're at the top of the castle, and then I decided to fly us out. Um, let's go... 
So we came through the little war torn area. And that's nice. Let's go up through here. Yeah, it's just a lot a lot of little like details. I feel like visually the maps like I don't know the right word to use crisper. Is that an appropriate uh term to use? It just looks like the it's the lighting is better, it's more vibrant. Like look, there's like four different shades of lighting going on in this image right here. And I feel like before everything looked kind of flat. Again, for lack of a better term, I'm no artist, so take everything I say about design with a grain, or at least like 12 grains of salt. But yeah, it's, you know, it's nicer. Anything different down in here? Oh, nice. Look at that. That's a roaring fire. Cackle in a way. There's no chimney, though, which is kind of a kind of a problem. Uh, the Costello engineers could probably spend some time on that, I think. Very nice. Another odd ramp that I can't fly over to for some reason. The gold room. It looks like uh, we got some new, new treasure to loot here. Somebody ripped the page. They must have ran out of TP. Interesting. Okay, very nice. I love how open this is. I will miss uh, the ballistas. This is now a ballista-free map, which you know, I've got mixed feelings about. But if it's if it's for the better of the map as a whole, then I'm all about it. Everything. Uh that's the second time. I wonder how many times these paintings appear in this map. I'm just kind of cruising around looking for new little details about stuff. Everything looks great. I'm 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 pleased. Oh, let's check out the hall here. Is it gonna let me fly through? It did. How about that? Oh, nice. Okay, so. You can just kind of like climb up the hill here and then like make a right and then boom, you're at the gates. So where's like the gate? Do the gates not, uh, is there no like crank anymore? Oh, you know what? I think the difference. Oh, there is a ballista. Oh, oh okay. A little sneaky sneaky. I'll put a mobile spawn point right here. And you guys will never get me alive. I wonder what the trajectory of the ballista is. Probably, I mean, it'd be kind of useless over here because you got the trees. So probably like from here to here, like to this rock. Oh, you know what I just realized? I'm not going to say anything, but let's see if you can figure it out. You know I'm going to be killing people on this ladder. <laughs> I'll see them climbing up and then pop. I'll pin them to the wall. Okay, so we do have a ballista. There is a ballista. I stand corrected. It looks like there's just one unless there's like another one tucked away somewhere. I'm like kind of scanning the tree line, but I'm not seeing one anywhere else. That's okay. I'm glad there's still one. I'll take it. Is there any, I don't think you can get on these walls. I mean, maybe you could open these doors. Oh, it won't let me go through. So maybe not. Yeah, that's, nah, that's locked. That is a lock right there. Okay. So let's go back and yeah, this side, you can go up the same way too. I imagine it's a mirrored image. Yeah, pretty much the same. Ammo crate right there. That's nice. Okay. And you got the ladders. This looks pretty similar. Okay. So you come up the staircase and then this is the same kind of a lot less clutter going on up here, which I like, but then you got these like, I don't even like, what would you describe these as like, uh, 
an open viewing window. Maybe these slide down. It doesn't look like it though. It looks like they're stuck on that outcropping right there. You'd think there'd be like a bucket of rocks or something like a pile of rocks right here. And then all oh, somebody, somebody joined and then they realized I'm not playing and they, they died. Okay, but that's, I'm excited. I'm excited to play some rounds with New Costello. I think I've covered every area of it. Come up here. Go through here. Yeah, look at this. It's all blocked off. You can't go back over there. There was really no reason to go back over there unless you're just trying to troll. There are cannonballs here, but is there a cannon? doesn't look like there's a cannon. Wait, what? Oh, that's, you can see through the island. Got it. Very nice. Very nice. Um, before I go for the day, I did want to swap over to Fatoria because in the patch notes, it vaguely says, let's see if I can find it real quick. It says they cleaned up Fatoria town area. And improved the layout. So I imagine they did what they did with uh, Costello. And they had a... What did I say? They had a yard sale. And they got rid of all the little... Like... Broken chairs and like sandbags and stuff. And so in... Uh, in Fatoria here, I think in that little courtyard area. It might be a bit different. Let's check it out though. This looks... a about the same. Yeah, this looks this looks pretty similar. I think this has been widened. Maybe. This just this looks a little bit wider to me. I the lighting looks different too. I don't know if it's because I'm in spectator mode. Oh, this looks a little different right here. Oh, look, you could probably jump up on this to get up there. I don't think that's, I think that's new right there. That little jump ramp. And so you can jump out here now too. It looks like there's some differences. All right. Nothing like incredibly major. Hey, the new lighting effect. What is this? What's this green light? Is that like, is that bleeding through? That's a little green there too. I wonder if this torch is causing that this strange alien light right here. That's really odd. Hey, they, oh, nice. Okay. Okay, we're seeing some difference. They're adding they're adding color to the map. I like that. Just like with Costello. You got some vines, some potted plants. I mean that bush has always been there, but there's a hole in the wall now. Is that Yeah, that's low enough you'll be able to jump up in there and then run up through here. This looks relatively the same. Once again, the rubble is on the outside, which suggests that, like, something blew up in here and knocked the wall out. I don't really know how that worked. I don't know if uh, they really thought that through. Just, just like the wall in Costello. This all looks very similar and familiar to me. I feel home right here for some for some reason. I don't see anything too different. Out here immediately. The caves are all here. Let's pan around on this side.
Yeah, this all looks the same as far as I can tell. I wonder if you can still go down here. Yeah, this is a good hiding spot, by the way. The more you know. Um. Yeah, I like the little splashes of green they added here and there. It's a nice touch. Oh, the archway is gone. How did I miss that? The archway is gone and the staircase is wider. Yeah, that's nice. They added some flowers down there. Tavern looks the same. Oh, the the uh, the little walls got blown out. That's nice. Because people have been building ballistas up here and they're just pelting the, the royals in the courtyard. So now they won't have like the shelter to do that. There's a weird little platform right here too. You can't climb out this window. Everything back here looks the same. That's a nice little banner up here. Carpet, nice. <laughs> what is this? <laughs> That's interesting. How you doing? Oh, even the even the nobles couldn't escape the Halloween curse. It looked like. I like the lighting here. That's gonna be really cinematic when you have some bad guys running at you down the shadowy hallway. But they took out the uh, they took out the little side room. Remember, this used to be closed off, and there would be a door here, and you could come in here. It's a really awkward room. This this does make it uh, look nicer. What in the world is going on here? <laughs> why why is this hole in the attic here? What is that? What I don't even know what that is. It's like a piece of wood sticking out. It's too dark to see anything though. Who knows what's up here with me? We may never know. Hmm. That's interesting. Okay, that's cool. So this building's different. And you still go in here? Nah, uh, that looks about the same. Did they add a attic? I always thought they would add a um Can I get over this? No, it doesn't look like it. I always thought they would add like an attic to this room, but it's not. Let's cruise on in here. That's a nice little book. That's sealed off. Is that a new candelabra? Maybe I've just never noticed it, but I feel like I would have noticed the melted wax. I think that's pretty cool looking. This room's been changed a bit. More windows. Nice. Oh, this is totally different. The roof's gone. Huh. It looks like the roof uh, is under construction. Interesting. Okay. It's still got the uh, the bridge. Like, the connections are all there. It's just not... Uh, the ladder that was here is gone. And the ladder on the inside is still there. Oh, there's a ladder right here now, too. Hmm. Okay. This is kind of like surprising me because the more I like look at the little stuff, the more I'm... Oh, there's a huge hole right here too. I wonder... Huh. I wonder what the purpose of some of these like random holes in the walls are. Where's the debris? It looks like a rock hit it, but the rocks would be coming from this side. So I don't, I don't know what happened here. Here, like, I guess a rock could, like, have come, like, perfectly over and then just kind of, like, down in here like that. I don't know. That's the only thing I can think of. Let's check this out over here. This area looks about the same. Let's check up top. 
This looks the same. Yeah, it all looks the same. Two ladders. There. Downstairs. Wait, is this? This is different down here. I never really come down in this part of Fatoria. I always feel like it's just a labyrinth. You know, you just stay out here and you run that way and you're fine. Let's check the bell tower just to be just to be thorough, you know, just to be thorough. I thought that <laughs> looking up, I was like, is that a light bulb? <laughs> yeah, the bell tower. Nice. Okay. And then you can still <laughs> they still have the uh, so when this map first came out, there was a cannon here and you could use the cannon to shoot over this wall and basically hit anything out here you wanted you the trick was or i guess not really the trick but the downside was you're sitting here so you have really no idea where your shots are going so like my friends they'd get on that wall and they'd like spot for me or i'd spot for them and that was really effective like it was almost too effective when you did something like that um but then you could also like accidentally like clip these uh the parts of the wall right here and then blow up and kill your teammates so they took the cannon out fairly quickly like i think within like a month of the map being out they took the cannon out but they've always left this platform here and i kind of expected something to happen like maybe they would just seal it off or i don't know but it, it's just always odd that there's this platform here that has really no purpose other than a memorial to what was probably not the greatest idea they had for this map okay i think i checked everything i'm gonna cruise down here oh is that can i is that medikit always been there let's check uh, oh we got a little plant there coming into the cellar here Yeah, I don't really come down here too much. So, like, all this stuff could be new and I just... I wouldn't know. Okay. Yeah. Yeah, I'm not down here enough to really know what's new. So, if you see something new, great. If you don't, well... It is what it is. <laughs> this is the other cave. Yeah. Oh, wait. The cave's moved. Oh, there's another cave. That's definitely new. So this is... Okay, that you can't go through there. So this one... Oh my gosh, this is truly a labyrinth now. You come down here, through here. Wow, yeah. I, I don't come down here enough. Oh, this is the... Uh, yeah, this is the Minecraft tunnel. Yeah, okay. Okay, cool. There's is that a fox? That's I don't ever remember seeing that. Oh, this poor guy. You hate to see it. Ding dong, the witch is dead. Yeah, new cave. How about that? That's pretty neat. Got a heavy hand axe, so oh. and nothing new over here. They add, I feel like the details in the background are new and they made this hilly like there's more hills now I feel like I don't remember seeing the guard towers uh, on the sides but then again like I said in the cellar I don't really look out there very often this, is, this looks about the same here this tree is different I think Yeah, the trees are a bit different. I think that tree is different too. Everything else looks about the same. I think this bridge is deeper or taller. Because you used to be able to shoot from the ballista like clear underneath the bridge. 
but now it's like you have this very small spot i think the ramp used to be higher and it was more like a gradual decline but this is kind of like flat and then it's up at the last second it's different that's different and then this these uh ramps right here that's cool let's check bank and spawn over here this all looks the same there's a well oh it's gonna end soon let's do a quick blitz run hey look the horse pooped the pumpkin how about that let's do a quick blitz around to the other side real quick before the match ends You still got your cabbages, you still got your carrots. You got some uh, pumpkins ready to go. How about that? Yeah, this could be rearranged and I'm just not recognizing it because I don't really come back here that often. If I'm back here, it's because I'm ready to run out that way. This gate is new. I'm fairly certain that gate is new. Oh, nice. They... The army came here, right? The army comes here. But why didn't they just sail down a bit further and then boom? Because that's the final objective right there. They could have just saved everybody a lot of time or just done a little drive-by. I think the shack is new too. Poor guy. Huh. How about that? Well, there you go. Some nice changes to uh, Fatoria as well. Oh, I feel like there's a story here, but we'll never know. Well, there you go. That's going to do it for today's video. Thank you so much for watching. That was a lot of fun exploring the new elements of the map. How about that? It's a victory for everybody when Mordhau gets a patch. It's also different out here now, it looks like, too. I forgot to check, but you'll figure it out. You'll discover stuff that I probably missed. And let me know in the comments if I missed anything particularly cool. But thank you so much for watching. If you liked the video, like the video. Please be sure to subscribe to catch more Mordhau in the coming days. Along with everything else I've been playing, join Discord. Say hello. Everybody's super nice. Have a great day. Stay safe, stay healthy. I'll catch you all next time.